fever? Milk fever, yep, so we see it um, in sheep, and we see it in sheep, we see it prior to lambing, which of course is a, a total opposite, or different to what we see in, in cattle, where we see the problem um, when the lactation starts coming on, when the, the cow starts to, bit, to run into difficulties in mobilising enough calcium. So in sheep, the draw, when the, when the, the fetal or the baby's skeleton is starting to get calcified, the draw on the ewe system at that stage um, is, is dramatic. And so what we see is we see um, milk fever or hypocalcemia is the term. We see this condition in ewes later in pregnancy. And we just get weak, floppy ewes on the ground. Um, and a typical metabolic ewe would call it. And it's kind of a, it can be difficult on occasion to work out whether that is due to pregnancy toxemia or, or uh, milk fever. I guess on the whole milk fever ewes tend to be in better condition and it can creep up in, in quite, quite well fed ewes as well. Um, and if we're using um, certain types of winter feed it can be, can be a problem as well.